Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft Edge for Desktop gives you the option to be able to expand Bing Chat in the side panel and to expand that side panel according to your own personal choice and preference. And I think this is handy, especially if you are getting um, longer responses from the chatbot or if you're dealing with long form documents. And the nice thing about this expanded state is if you close Edge, and you relaunch the browser, it actually, as you can see, remembers the size of the site panel, which I think is a nice move, uh, especially if you are using the Copilot for the web on a regular basis. Now, as many of you may know, recently Microsoft rolled out the new Windows Copilot for Windows 11, which basically is a Bing Chat web container on the desktop. And this rolled out with the recently released um, Moment 4 feature update. But currently, there is no option to be able to increase and expand the size of the actual web container. As you can see, there's no option to do that. Now, this may be set to change. And if we head over to a GIF and screenshot provided by Windows Latest, here we can see um, that although Microsoft hasn't officially announced this new feature, um, being able to resize and expand Windows Copilot on the Windows 11 desktop is currently undergoing testing uh, in the Windows 11 Insider program in the Windows 11 preview bolts. And as you can see, it gives you the ability to be able to expand and open Windows Copilot uh, in your preferred size, as I demonstrated over in Microsoft Edge. And this, as mentioned, is especially handy when working with long documents or when more space is needed for the chatbot uh, to give you responses, as an example. And um, it'll be interesting to see if Microsoft uh, will give uh, us the option um, in the future to remember the SARS, as I demonstrated with Microsoft Edge in the side panel. And it's also going to be interesting to see if they will allow us to be able to undock uh, Copilot and use it in any form um, that we want in the future. Um, and that's going to be interesting to see. But nonetheless, this is early days. And at this stage, not known when this will roll out and if it will roll out to the stable version of Windows Copilot for desktop. But just wanted to bring it to your attention because I actually think this might be a handy feature and a nice move in the right direction, being able to um, expand that to your own personal choice and preference. And obviously, like all things that are new on the channel, I will keep a close eye on this one and I'll let you know if there are any more changes. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.